Rennet, are you hungry? Rennet, look at me. Look at your fans in the camera. Say good morning. <laughs> good morning, everyone. So first things first is Redneck is hungry. Bingo, enjoy. All right, guys, I just literally just woke up about 10 minutes ago. I probably got dark circles under my eyes, and of course I'm ready for oh, my coffee. So I have this cool frother here. I just pour some half and half in. Boom. Got a lid over here. Boom. Yeah, that would help if I plugged it in. All right, and then you just click that little button right there, and it starts frothing. Now, I like live by this Nespresso coffee. Not an ad, I'm just showing you guys that I love this. Got my little capsules here. Pop that bad boy in right there. Close it. Boom. Gotta get my cup. <laughs> And then you hit this good old green button right here. And the magic will start to brew. What's going on over there? What's going on? Mm, mm, mm. Magic. All right guys, so this coffee maker is amazing and they get kind of pricey, not gonna lie but this one is really affordable. So if you guys wanna check it out, I do have an Amazon store now and I put it in the Amazon store. It's either under in the kitchen or coffee and chocolate because I'm a little obsessed with coffee. Um, if you guys watch my videos, you do know I drink a lot of coffee. So today is going to be a crazy eventful day. Um, I'm building a little project for Jake and Luke. Uh, Gabe, Jake and Luke are in Georgia right now. Do I? But check it out. It's kind of rainy this morning. Like, honestly, I just want to stay in bed and not do anything. But <sighs> I got to do something. Check it out. In my head, it's going to be great. Hello. I haven't put it together yet. But in the comments below, before watching the rest of this video, because I might put it in there, uh, comment what you think I'm doing and what you think it's for. All right, back to my coffee. Come on, Renek. So if you can't tell already, this video is totally a vlog style video because you know what? I'm gonna go dive or snorkel off the beach today and I've never been there before. So it's gonna be a completely new experience. I don't really know what to expect. It could be amazing. It could just be a beach. So we're gonna find out. But first things first, we're gonna drink our coffee. Gosh, you're a loud eater, redneck. All right guys, so I am super motivated now, thanks to my coffee. But we're gonna run to the store and get some spray paint for that little project I'm doing out back because you know what? I want it to look nice. And it, it might look nice with the spray paint, but it don't matter because it's going in the jungle anyway, so. I just want to kind of camouflage it a little bit so it's not like a bang like spanking bright piece of plywood back there so i'm gonna get some like black brown and like dark green spray paint and kind of camouflage it a little bit there it goes. all right so this is my game plan here i have a plank of plywood on top and i got these pieces of wood for the sides boom boom and then one in the middle for support got some screws got a drill and I'm gonna go to work. First screw in. One and done. One and done. <laughs> I got my girlfriend Chelsea behind the camera helping me today. And we also went snorkeling together. So, we get right back. He's gone. <laughs> so, when me and Gabe were gone for a weekend, we let the neighbors watch Redneck. And now that's like his grandparents' house. Every single time we let him outside, he's in their backyard. Just, oh my screw fell off. He's in their backyard baying up squirrels up trees and everything. He gets treats and so he loves it over there. And every time, that's where he just went. He just crawled behind the fence and he went in their backyard. Let's put another bad boy in here. Did 
this is gonna be so sick. <laughs> I'm so excited. I might be more excited than the boys. <laughs> this is what I'm making this bridge for. Because every time me, Gabe, the kids, Redneck, go down in this creek, hold up, there's this little area that floods and it gets all muddy. Right here. So, Luke's always down here and he's like, Kelly, let's build a bridge. And he's always grabbing like sticks and leaves and like not making a bridge, but he thinks he's making a bridge. So, I went to Home Depot, or Lowe's I should say, and bought some plywood and some wood. And I'm kind of winging it. Never built a little bridge before, but I think it's going to work. And I'm just going to place it right here. So the kids and Gabe come down here a lot and make videos and just to play. <laughs> Gabe has antlers back there in the uh, water right now. Getting all cleaned off by them prawns. But, alright, I'm going to get back to building this bridge. That way when the kids come back from Georgia, it's going to be a little surprise. Should have hit that plank. All right, guys. So I'm pretty much almost done with this. I have one more screw to put in, and I think it's pretty solid. It's solid. <laughs> I think the only thing I would have done different is if you come over here. This middle plank I put in the center just for like support. I think I would have took this and cut it into thirds and had them go along this way. But it's a pretty narrow bridge anyway, so it's not like you're gonna like break it fall through. It's pretty, pretty sturdy. I think I'm gonna run, get some spray paint, decorate it a little bit, make it all camo um, in with the woods. I think it'd be really cool, so. We're gonna get to that. Right, guys, we made it here. It's quite windy out here. Sorry if there's wind in the mic, but Chels and I are getting ready. I'm we so got excited. all the dive gear ready. This is Chelsea's like kind of Hi. first time ever like snorkeling, I think. <laughs> this is Chelsea's first time putting on a wetsuit as well. <laughs> I'm struggling. <laughs> I gave her the one you gotta lube up. Jesus she got Christ. Wet. <laughs> Listen, you gotta, you gotta, sometimes you gotta struggle a little bit when you go dive. This is a workout itself. There you go. Who needs cardio? <laughs> well, we're about to be doing a lot of cardio. <laughs> so we're gonna see what's out there. We don't know, but we'll see y'all out in the water. It looks super flat out there. I'm really surprised it's kind of breezy out. All right. Chels, you ready? So ready. Ready to explore. So I put my fins on and I walk backwards.
Hey, Chels. Chelsea. Chelsea. Let's go to the bridge. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little too murky. All right, guys. So plan B. This one spot that we went to, the water was just really murky. I dove down. You know, there was kind of like a smooth, rocky area. I saw one little fish, but that's about it. But we didn't really explore it too much because the water was just really, really chalky. So we're gonna try uh, Cato's Bridge next. Uh, see how the water clarity is. We did just have a cold front, so it might be a little murky, but we'll find out. The water looks a lot better here, as you can see. So, whew, a little chilly, but <laughs> we're going in. Was the smoke? I didn't see it. I think so. <laughs> she said, what is that? <laughs> she said the big one. Probably snook. down there all right so the water was kind of murky at the bridge as well um, but we saw a bunch of snook a really nice starfish but I was getting a little chilly so I'm like you know what let's call it quits let's get some food and check out this salad I have right here yeah um talk about health it's so beautiful <laughs> it is we're at the three natives here in Tequesta Florida right now and I just got a little cappuccino with oat milk at this super cute coffee store next door. So we're gonna go ahead and enjoy our lunch and then we're gonna get to building that bridge that I'm gonna build in the backyard for the boys. And I think I'm gonna spray paint it as well too. So I'll see you guys back at the house. He's back. Redneck is back. Hello. Redneck, come here. Come here. Come here, Redneck. Come here. Oh, guys. I think our little bridge here is redneck approved. What do you think? You like it? It makes you taller, huh? He's been over at the neighbors while we've been diving all day. Oh, I know, I missed you too, redneck. But me and Chelsea are gonna go ahead and carry this back to where I'm gonna put it, and then we're gonna spray paint it. Hopefully it's gonna come out good, and we'll find out. You ready, redneck? We're gonna go paint this. Redneck. Bro, Redneck, I built the bridge so you could walk on it. Dogs will be dogs. Alright guys, check it out. It's pretty cool. I like it. Walk across. Now you don't get Fancy. your feet muddy. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to get the spray paint in. Check this out. This one's 
camouflage. on it but I can't. <laughs> yeah, I think that's definitely where you can't. Alright guys. Redneck ice oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> again. It's alright the bridge is still wet but I think it came out really good. I'm so excited. Look at that. They're gonna love it. I know. I honestly I'm obsessed. <laughs> but it's gonna be so cool. So when it rains, see, look over there. See the water over there? The water comes in and just that? makes this all muddy. And then there's higher land over there. So this will be perfect once we walk down here. It bows down into a little ditch right here. So that's perfect for the bridge. Obviously you walk across the bridge when it's not wet with paint. And then now you're on high ground. All right, guys, this has been a super cool day. Just really going out there exploring. You know, water was a little chalky, but that's okay. We did some home construction here. We got a little bridge put up for the kids. Swam with a bunch of snook, had a good lunch. And I just wanna say thank you to everyone who watches my channel. Thanks for subscribing, thanks for supporting. Thanks for checking out Blue Gabe's channel as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.